second day of joint practices. How has the last two days been for you guys? Competitive, fun, um, just high emotion. Going out against a different team, obviously always great, you know, seeing different people and just going out put, putting together good practice. I know you don't have the pads on or anything, but you talk about the competitive spirit and competitive nature. How do you still get that on a day like today? Um, you can still get it just without tackling, just, you know, uh, mentally winning and just, you know, tagging off. I know you don't need preseason ball, but what are you hoping to gain in game two? And what about the other guys that need to step up? I would say just for myself, uh, just less. Huh. What's the good? Because mm, we, we just less mental mistakes. I feel like we had too many in the, in the first drive we had last week and just trying to trying to minus those. <laughs> How much uh, work do you hope to get uh, Monday night? However long I'm in, I'm going to compete to the highest. And, you know, I, I don't. I don't have that answer for you. That's for Coach Smith. Your coach was telling me about a route down there uh, at the end there. Could you walk us through that? We were kind of far away. Um, I just had a go, and I just knew it was my time to win one-on-one. -on -one and you know, I, yeah, the ball didn't go, you know, come my way. But I mean, it came my way, but it was, it was unfortunate. It was incomplete, but, you know, it's okay. We'll get it back. How, how good was that work, that 14-6 to six situational work at the end for the offense? It's a good situation of football, just – you know, having us think differently and, you know, knowing there's no timeouts, different score, we know we need to score, so that's something different. That coach, that coach called you a, a creative player. And then, uh, uh, obviously, that's a, a big compliment, but from last year to this year, what do you think you've grown the most uh, as a receiver, as a tight end, period? I would say mentally, I feel like I've grown just before the, before the ball snaps, just trying to Still, while I'm trying to get faster at it, seeing the ball post-snap, pre-snap, um, just maturing mentally first. Did you see that comment that he said you're like a crazy player in Madden? <laughs> yeah, I seen it. And, uh, like it? <laughs> it, was, it was pretty cool. <laughs> if, if you were to make your own player on Madden, would you come out kind of like you? Close to it. <laughs> 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 What's your score? I, I don't follow the score. I know that Alex James came out yesterday. What's the score? What's your uh, rating? I think that's what they call it. I haven't even I haven't played it yet. I haven't played it yet, but when I get back home to Atlanta, I'll play it. Do you feel like uh, you and Mariota and Ritter have a, a deeper feel for each other as far as when you get out there going against somebody else? Uh, definitely, because like like you said, somebody else, not our team. Um, they're running different defense and right. just more reps and, and relationship. You know, it'll grow. As for Desmond, you see him get more and more comfortable out there. Yeah, I, was, I would say so. What about what the progress he's made from day one to now is what? I mean, I, I don't. I wouldn't say I've been watching just him specifically, sure. but just I feel like he's done a great job just gradually getting better. We're doing something on Rashawn about Grady talking to him about the guy that steps up this year and it becomes a household name. Um, when you have to go against him and go over the middle, uh, is he the kind of guy you have to do that <laughs> where number 54 is at? I mean, everybody's a competitor on our defense, so just everybody gets the you know, utmost respect, and I, I want to win against everybody. So, But Rashawn, he does, he, he's a great leader, and you know, he's a great guy. Where are y'all at in establishing the identity of the offense? I feel like our our identity of the offense is still growing, and you know we we're going to add another step to it this this coming Monday, and just keep stacking weeks.